going on today, YouTube. So I am here with a little redo knockoff penny board. And uh, yeah, what I find interesting is the sanded grip on here. Definitely very interesting touch. This was 43 bucks at Target. It's got the skate stopper on there. And uh, yeah, so let's see what the specs are on this thing. Flexible deck, soft wheels, super fast bearings. That doesn't help me at all. So this is a 22 and a half by six inch deck, low flex, high poly, polyropylene deck, whatever that is, full, full color grip tape, 11 and a half inch wheelbase, um, 60 millimeter, 82A, super soft wheels. Yeah, because 82 is not all that soft for a cruiser board. But uh, yeah, super smooth, 84A medium bushings, and ABEC 5 speed bearings. So what we're going to do is we're going to take all the loss prevention stuff on this beast off, and uh, yeah, just pretty much skate it through Old Town Arvada. So uh, let's take this and the wheel stopper off and uh, see how it does. So uh, other than that, I'll meet you guys outside.
So, whew. the bearings are doing okay. I mean, I feel like the wheels are fairly good, but uh, right now, I'm gonna upgrade the bearings and see if that makes any sort of a difference. So uh, yeah, let's get to it and uh, upgrade the bearings.
So let's start with some good things about this board. The wheels and bearings that came on this board were actually not too bad and definitely I feel like were a lot better than Walmart wheels and bearings because of the bearings on a Walmart board are definitely made a lot more of like plastic and when you put them under any sort of load like you know skating wise they just melt or at least the shield melts and then the ball bearings are unsealed so uh, yeah they end up coming out and just like basically disintegrating and then these wheels definitely feel like they're a lot higher quality and a lot sturdier than what comes on a Walmart board and definitely something that would be worth investing into. But uh, yeah, I feel like, you know, these are good starter wheels and bearings. But uh, yeah, I did end up upgrading the bearings just to get a little more extra oomph out of the wheels. But um, yeah, the deck definitely had a lot less flex to it than I thought it was going to, especially for being, you know, plastic and whatnot. But other than that, um, the grip does seem to like does seem to come off around the edges a little bit but um it's a plastic penny board what are you going to expect but uh, other than that um the only main complaint i have about this board is probably the trucks i believe i've tried to replace trucks on these before with to just no avail and they just don't seem to ever line up properly and i don't know if that's just the size of the department store brand boards that tend to do that but I definitely the trucks are plastic and they don't line up with ordinary trucks so I feel like wheels and bearings are definitely going to be as far as you can upgrade on this board before you have to just get a whole new one and yeah so uh other than that um overall a pretty sturdy board um just once the trucks go I see yourself probably having to get rid of the whole board and maybe just I don't know tossing it out but uh, other than that um yeah, like I said, it's an overall very sturdy board. Like, comment, and subscribe. See you guys next video.